I'm Nadine from Juggle Mum and I'm sat on my kitchen floor because I want to show you this Hoover vented tumble dryer which I have here. Um, this one is a Hoover Infinity and it's a front loading tumble dryer. Let me show you how it works. This one has got a really large drum. It's got nine kilograms worth of drum, which is fabulous because across the kitchen I have my washing machine and that too is a large capacity machine. So I can take everything straight out of there into the dryer and it will take the full load. Um, here is some washing, which I'm just going to put in so that I can show you how it works. Move that out of the way. There is a filter in the front of the machine. Now I left this dirty after the last um, operation so that I could show you how we clean it because this perplexed me at first. I wasn't sure how to clean it. What you do is you pull these two little um, raised parts in the center, pull them apart and you get all of the fluff in the middle. So you simply fluff picks up fluff so it's a good idea to remove the bulk from the middle and then just run it over the rest of the filter to clean. That can go in the bin. And now I have a nice clean filter. That just slots into place at the front here. Because it's vented, I've actually got this um, plumbed in for want of a better word. And the hose is going out of the back of the machine and out of the house. So uh, this is different than a condensed tumble dryer. But um, you've always got to make sure the filter is pushed into place. My load is in there, shut the door, and then on the front of the machine, there's a lot of settings. Um, and we start with off. If you want to come closer, I can show you the setting that I'm going to choose. So here, the, we're starting from off. I like a nice timed dry because then that way I tend to go for 75 minutes. I know that after that period of time, my drying is going to be dry. However, it also has a sensor system, which means that you can pick um, a type of dry at this side. So I might go for iron dry um, or bone dry, cupboard dry, and that way you can dry it to the level that you choose. So that, for example, if you want to do it for an iron dry, you can finish off the dry um, the, the clothes won't be bone dry, but you can use your iron then afterwards. So you can do that and this, the machine will gauge the weight of the washing you're putting in there. Personally, I do tend to like a timed dry just so that I know when it's going to be finished because you don't know when it's going to finish when you use this one. Um, it has a delayed start, which I haven't found reason to use yet. Um, so I can't comment on that. But then you can also use um, push the delicates button if you've got delicates in there. I don't today, so I'm going to leave it that way. You can see my start button flashing. So I'm going to press it once, which puts it on the pause setting. And there we go. Off you go. Um, now it's drying. The machine is actually drying now. You can hear it. It's not too noisy. I actually like and know what's going on. Sometimes I've had tumble dryers which are really quiet and you don't know whether they're doing anything or not. So I really like this one. Um, it's been good so far. I've only had it for a few days. I'm still getting used to it, but so far so good.